Have you flown anything before? Yes, uh, I'm an Air Force. Air Force, yes. What have you flown? Uh, no. Uh, uh, an engineer? Engineer. Engineer, yes. okay. Yes. Have you seen aircraft fly? Uh, okay. Yes, okay. So when now you're going to be it. Because everybody here is going to learn how to fly from you. Yeah. <laughs> leader, leader. <laughs> He's the leader. Okay, put your hand on the stick here. Okay, this, this more control. Okay. This is the side stick controller. This is how you steer the aircraft. Okay. okay. So when you want to climb, you want to bring the nose off the ground and take off. Okay. You're going to pull back on the stick. This is uh, more pitch up. Pitch up is pitch back. <laughs> And you want the nose to go low, you're going to pitch forward. forward okay? and you want to turn to the left, you're going to pull to the left. That's right, sorry. Right, and then left is that way. Right, right? I mean, I'm getting my own sides mixed up. Okay, hand on the throttle. 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 That's idle, that's minimum power. Okay. Push it forward, that's maximum military power. Okay. Rotating up, now push forward. Afterburner. Okay. Afterburner is what we're going to use for takeoff, okay? The last thing you need to learn is when that reaches 150, okay, 150, you're going to lift off. You're going to pull back okay. on the stick. Okay. okay, you don't need to pull anymore. Just gradually climb. You can relax your hand. Relax your hand, okay? The hand goes on to the landing gear. Watch, watch, look down here. Landing gear. Landing your hand up. The first exercise between you and me is I want to show how you can control the pitch. So push forward, you're up at 15 degrees, 18 degrees nose high. Push forward, bring that flight path marker down. Push forward on the stick. Okay, I'm asking you to push forward on the stick to come down to level flight. Right there is level flight. Now you're not climbing and you're not descending. That's the horizon. All right? Now we're also going to maximize the flight of the aircraft. And I want you to pull hard to the left, all the way around for 360 degrees, the whole circle. So okay. pull hard left. Okay, I will uh, circle 250 degrees. Okay. One, two, three, pull left. This is pull left. Watch. Oh, stop. Okay. So what I'm trying to train you with is that when you stop the pressure on the stick, it just stays where it is. So now, we push to the left, now I want you to do that on your own to the right, all the way around. Okay, roll. Roll to the right. And roll to the right. Roll to the right, go ahead. Or the left. Okay, now try that to the right. The other right. He likes left, doesn't he? Okay. Try the other right. Try the other right. This one. There you go. There you go. That was pretty fast. Matter of fact, he wanted to do a double, I think. Okay, so you kind of have the idea where you go, and when you stop the pressure, he just wants to stop right there. So now we're going to practice the pull in the vertical. So now I want you to pull your nose up to 45 degrees. There's okay. five degrees. So loop, yes. Loop. Pulse. Loop. A loop, yeah. yeah loop. So first off, just pull straight back on the stick. Okay. Throttle, just, just leave the throttle right there. Okay. It'll help you out. Okay, we're going up. Pull straight back. Pull straight back. Straight back. Oh. Okay, you're going through about 30. You're going through 45. Keep going. Keep pulling okay. straight back. Just pull straight back. Just keep pulling straight back. Don't worry about left or right. Just keep pulling straight back. Straight back. Now, when you come pulling through here at the bottom here, you want to keep pulling straight back. Straight back, straight back, straight back. Keep going. You haven't finished yet. You got to come all the way up to the horizon. Pull back on the stick. You're 25 degrees nose low. Pull back on the stick to bring it up to the horizon. Pull more, pull more, pull more. Pull more, pull more. You're 10 degrees nose low. Five more and stop. You went a little bit high here. There's the horizon right down there. Okay, so there you did a loop. Uh, there is something we have in the aircraft that protects you because I have a feeling many here are wondering how would you crash it? I don't want to crash this. But we're going to show that this right here, pull this power back, right to there is good. That we, so you have your aircraft with your wings low here. We're going to pull back as fast as hard as you can. Pull back as hard as you can, backward. Pull back, I'll help you. There we go. Pull nine G's, there's nine G's. Boom. You have just you have just fallen asleep. Take your hand off the stick. 
you've fallen asleep and it takes you 30 seconds to wake up, you, you're, you're unconscious, that's five seconds. You're unconscious still, that's 10 seconds. Your flight lead is telling you, knock it off, knock it off, that's 15 seconds. That's 20 seconds, you are still not awake because you're unconscious. That's 25 seconds. No, no, no. You haven't touched it. You haven't touched it. That's 30 seconds. You're just now becoming alert that something's going on, and this saved you from crashing in the aircraft. Okay? Okay, now put your hand on the stick. We're going to go hunting for aircraft. I'm working it. <laughs> That's not a sit. That's not a, uh, a radar track yet. Can you roll the uh, strobe down? Is that what the or is it roll the strobe up a little bit? Like the L strobe is a little bit too low. Mm. Okay, here's the bad guy in front of you. Okay. He's going to be right up here. Okay. Pardon me a second. This is saying that you're in range against this bad guy right here. Okay. It's right there. This is the in range cue that's inside that. Mm -hmm. So when I take you off a of freeze, I want you to shoot him. He's off to the right. Okay. So to do that, take your thumb, push that button down once. Push once. And release. Oh, He's not going after the right one. Maybe he got out of this field of view here. Okay, we're going to shoot the one up here. And fire away here. See the one right up there? Yeah. Oh, okay. Didn't get there yet. Oh. You just cleared the skies of all the bad guys here. You get to do a victory roll, so roll hard left. Hard left, keep going, all the way around. Roll, roll, roll. Roll, yeehaw! Yeah. <laughs> Jester's dead. Okay, push your nose over. Okay, after every good mission, you gotta go back and get not only weapons, but you gotta get fuel, so we gotta go back and land safely. Hold okay. this. Okay. Pull back. There you go. Put your landing gear handle down here. Handle down. Push down. Push this down. Okay. Your job is to fly this and aim it at that part right there. Beginning of the runway. You would see it. You would see the symbol that shows where it is. All right? So then you can just turn around and go shake it. If it's a little bit low, you're going to want to pull the nose up a little bit. Pull back on the stick. You get warnings. need to pull back on the stick. You get warnings, so you know. You want to put this right there. So if someone wants to get a warning, you get a warning. You get a tone, a message, so you would know that. It's just a little bit low, so you need to pull back just a little bit. A little bit harder and aft, back. There you go, that's good. Right there, that's a good aim point. It just drifted a little bit high, so let the nose drop a little bit, because you don't want to land halfway down the runway. So we're going to let the nose drop. Aiming right there at the beginning of the runway.
doing well. Mm -hmm. uh, this is landing. This is landing, yes. Hold that, hold that, hold that. Don't don't need to go up anymore. Just hold hold that, hold that, hold that. And you landed the aircraft. Mission is complete. Okay. Okay. Not bad for an engineer. Okay. Thank you. Alright. Thank you.